Hey yo, what's up my math party people? I'm Anderson, your ASVAB coach. And in this video, I got a really cool one for you because this is actually a super easy problem as long as you understand what the story is telling you. So let's go ahead and dive on in. And remember, at the end of the video, if you liked it, just drop a like, leave a comment, let me know that you're alive, that you are supported by us, so we're good to go. But this is how easy this problem can be. At first, it might seem complicated. You might be looking at this and you might be saying, hey, okay, what's the straight line distance? Three feet, four feet, okay, add them together, that's seven. Where's seven, where's seven? I don't see seven on the answer choices. Right, that's typically the, the, the refreshing kind of, uh, the person who is just starting out and studying, that's what they might say. But for us, with enough practice, we might remember this little thing called the Pythagorean theorem. A squared plus B squared equals C squared. Let me show you exactly what I mean by this. So. Let me go ahead and draw like a little triangle here. Something like that, right? Let me draw this and I'm gonna show you exactly what we've got going on. So we'll see something to the effect of this, just to make it a little more realistic. So it says, what is the straight line distance? So straight line distance between Charles and Betty. So let's go ahead and say that Betty is down here and Charles is over here. Let me just show you what's going on in my party people. This is super straightforward. So we have uh, over here, blah, blah, blah. So three feet north. Charles is three feet north. So we have three feet north. And then we have four feet west. So this is right here, four feet to the west. So again, from Betty, Charles is three feet north and four feet to the west. Cool. Now, what do you notice? Well, if you're going north, and then you're going west, that's a 90 degree angle. Now, if you realize that this is a right triangle, boom, you're in business. Because remember, with right triangles, you have the Pythagorean theorem. Let me write this down for you. Pythagorean theorem. And that's gonna be a squared plus b squared equals c squared. Now, we might need a little refresher, right? What's A, what's B, what's C? So remember that the only thing you need to know is that C, the one that's by itself, is the hypotenuse, the longest side, the one across from that right angle. Again, the longest side. So this is C, or the hypotenuse. So you can say that four feet is A, the three feet is B. You can say that the four feet is B, the three feet is, it doesn't matter. It's just the C that is always gonna be the hypotenuse. And look, I know how awesome it is to watch these videos, but how much better would it be to actually sit in a live Zoom class with me, being able to answer your questions and show you how to get things done back to back to back. I got your back. Go ahead and join our program trial. It's free for a full week. I am so confident that it'll help you raise your score that I'm not even requiring a credit card for you to sign up. All you have to do is confirm your email and phone number and you're good to go. So what are you waiting for? Go ahead, click the link in the description or text TRIAL to 833-321-0182 and I'll see you there, my ASVAB party people. Let's raise that score. So all we need to do, my party people, all we need to do is plug in these numbers into the Pythagorean theorem and solve. That's it. That is it. So let's do that nice, calm, cool, and collected and let's see what the answer is. And as a reminder, we have a free practice test with video solutions that gives you way more practice than this on YouTube and you can go ahead and download it. Um, you can have it offline to watch the videos and video solutions. And on top of that, it gives you a free class once a week with me on Zoom. So go ahead and take a second after this video, check the link in the description of the video to get my free practice test and register for the free classes. That way you can free, you know, free up some time and space and stress and raise your score. So here we have it. We have A squared plus B squared equals C squared. So we can say four squared plus three squared equals whatever c squared is. Now four squared, that's four times four and that's 16. Three squared, that's three times three and that's nine. Add those together and you get 25. So what do we do lastly here? Remember that the last thing we'll do is do the opposite operation. So to get rid of a square, you do the square root. So we'll take the square root of both sides and it's gonna give you c equals five. So that'll be five feet away, and booyah, that's gonna be A, five feet. So knowing your Pythagorean theorem, but more importantly, knowing when it applies is so, so, so important. 
And so, as always, my party people, I really want, you know, really want to see you succeed. So with that, don't forget to register for that free practice test with those video solutions, with the free class. It's way too important and way too awesome to look over. And then on top of that, make sure to like this video, leave a comment, and subscribe to the channel if you support us, if you do. So I love you, my party people. I'm Anderson, your ASVAB coach, and I'll see you in the next video. Cheers. And before you go, if you like what you saw and you want to raise your score with thousands of practice problems just like that, so you can lower that test anxiety, raise that confidence, go to this link right here to check out the full program. There's a video that shows you exactly how it works, but you're going to get lessons, guided practice, worksheets, speed drills, and everything that you need to feel supported from day one all the way until you pass. Again, I'm Coach Anderson, and I'll see you soon.